Good morning, YMCA family. My name is Jennifer, and I am here with today's workout of the day, which looks a little bit different than usual. Today's workout is an agility ladder workout. So what is agility? Agility training is something that a lot of athletes do, and it allows them to stop, start, and change directions in short bursts and very quickly, utilizing proper posture so that they don't fall or get hurt. Agility training is really, really great no matter what age, um, because we're always in situations where we need to change movements quickly. Even when you're at the grocery store, for example, you're walking in, you're at the end of the aisle and somebody comes in front of you and you've got to quickly stop your movement and redirect your body. So this is a really great method. We're going to start incorporating this a little bit more into some of our um, workouts of the day. But let's talk about the agility ladder. So I know not everybody has one of these, but they are really easy to make. You can Google it. Um, what you're going to do is find this one actually has 10 rungs. So what I would encourage you to do is purchase or get from your local paint store 10 stirring sticks. So they're about, I think, 15, 12, 15 inches long. Then you're going to use duct tape and tape them all the way down. Most agility ladders are about 20 feet long. Give or take, you can make yours as long as you want. For all of our exercises today, we're going to go down and back, and we're going to keep continuing that exercise for a minute. So it really doesn't matter how long um, your ladder is because you're just going to keep doing the same thing. We've got that time interval. So really easy to make. Let's go ahead and talk a little bit about today's exercises. So as I mentioned, everything is for one minute. All exercises are going to be down and you're going to come back. So you're going to need some space to do these. You may need to take this out into your yard. My demonstrations today are going to be a little bit modified um, just because of our space. But let's go ahead and get started. So our first exercise after you've warmed up is going to be a lateral push-up. So you're going to start at the far left-hand side of your ladder. I'm going to start in the middle just so you can see. You're going to come down to your push-up position. You've got one hand in one square and another hand in the other square. You're going to come down, give me a push-up, then we're going to walk it down the line. So everything's moving down one square all the way to the end. Once you're at the end, you're coming back and you're going to stay here for a minute. These can be done on your knees as well. You're here. Then you're going to come to a plank position, move it down, push up on your knees. Plank, move it down, push up on your knees. All right, that's our first exercise. Second exercise is speed skaters. We do these a lot. However, this ladder is going to challenge us a little bit. So we're going to start standing in the middle, one of our squares, and you're going to speed skate. I want you to land in another square, and I want you to remember how many squares are in between. So for me, it's two. I'm coming back. So I'm keeping those two squares in between. I'm going to challenge myself. I want three squares. So here to here, to here, to here. So speed skaters, one minute. Exercise number three, lateral plank shoulder taps. So we're coming back down just like we were for those push-ups. Plank position. You've got a tap, a tap, and we're moving it down the line. Tap. Tap, moving it down. Moving one square each time. When you hit the end, you're going back to the top, repeating for one minute. All right, quick feet. Quick feet or football feet is how you may know these. Starting at one end, feet stay outside the ladder. You're moving quick all the way down. You're going to turn around, quick feet all the way back to the opposite side. Continuing with that pattern. 
All right, in out squats. We've got 10 of these exercises, by the way, guys. This is number five, so we're halfway. So we're starting inside our ladder. Squat, outside, in, out, in, out, in, out. You get the drill. Turn around and come back. Exercise number two, lateral banded side steps. So you're gonna need this band, you're gonna slip into it, keeping it low around your legs. I'm not gonna put mine on just for the sake of time. You're gonna start at one end, small step, small step, stepping into each one of your ladders with that band on, booty stays low. Then you're coming back. All right, guys, nice work. Number seven, we've got high knees and a shuffle back. So starting at the far end, you've got high knees in each square. Once you get to the end, you're shuffling back and you're going again. Exercise number eight, we've got single leg hops. So again, starting at the far end, right leg, around and switch legs. Nice job guys. Two more. Lateral bear crawl. So we're coming back down to the floor. Tabletop position right here. I want you to tuck those toes under and lift your knees up off the ground. So as those knees come up off the ground, you're engaging that core. And we're working our way down the line. Now, remember guys, body stays in tabletop, so I don't want to see that rear end up. Legs stay at 90 degree angles, working your way down. And remember, we talked about agility drills being quick movements. So I'm going through these rather slow so that you can see what each exercise is. But I want you to add some speed to these drills. So as you're doing your lateral bear crawls, you've got some speed, all while maintaining that good form. All right guys, last exercise. We've got two hops forward, one hop back. So using your rungs, to count. We're skipping two if you can, hopping back one, skipping two, hopping back one. So I'm here, 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 and here, here. Awesome job guys. Utilize what you've got as I said, this is a really great tool. We're gonna to start to use a little bit more in these workouts. So, go get it done. What I want you to do, complete all of these exercises a total of three times, so three rounds. Then you're done, you're out of here. Have an awesome day, guys. See you tomorrow.